God, that intro is so hard. All right. Hey, hey, I am back with some more P3 Reload. Uh, last time I spent an immeasurable amount of time in Tartarus for no reason. The last two times I played, one of which will never see the light of day. Just because it was 100% grind, no actual story stuff. Um, pretty much spent two and a half hours in Tartarus and like barely leveled up anything. Just because it takes so long to level up without the boss enemies. But anyways, uh, we did that. We also got to do some more stuff leading up to uh, the full moon, which is pretty soon. We talked to Fuka. We had an interesting development with Fuka. That was quite enjoyable. Um, we hung out with Junpei. We hung out with, uh, where is she, Yukari. That was fun. We hung out with Yuko last time, maybe? No, I don't think we did. That might be a lie. I might be lying. But anyways, um... Get out of my fucking phone. So I got a choice here between who I want to talk to. I kind of want to talk to Junpei just because he might get a characteristic from this. I don't know. Um, looks like I won't level anything up, but I want to see if like I could super boost these fucking spinaches. I think this is... Jesus. I think this is like the third or fourth time I've had somebody help me with this specific batch of vegetables. Man. All this non-stop watering and weed pulling, not to mention the bugs. It's pretty much like Tartarus, isn't it? It's pretty monotonous. Kind of just feels like busy work. That's fair. I mean, definitely takes uh, not only uh, focus, but patience. Think of it like we're training. <laughs> You're guarded like a lover. <laughs> like a what? What does that even mean? <laughs> That's what I want to know. But, uh, Maybe you have a point. I should not leave you two alone, then. You gotta treat it with love and kindness. Sound about right, oh wise one? Yeah, pretty much. Gotta say, you've got a long way to go before these veggies put us on easy street. Yeah, like four anyway, days. I'm the one who asked you to join me in the first place, so I gotta be the one to look out. <laughs> Even though I planted them. Da -da -da -da! The veggies have leveled up. I better be able to harvest a fucking lot of these. Of hard, honest work. Let's head back downstairs. At least I'll know if I can stack it or not. <sighs> Full moon day. I'm ready to fight this uh this shadow. I wonder what it's, which one it's gonna be. It's not hero fence, it's not lovers, it's not um hermit, because we just did hermit. Um it's not priestess. Uh, I wonder if it's gonna be like it's not chariot or justice. I wonder if it's gonna be like tower. Like if we're gonna have like maybe it's because I think the ones that we have left we have tower that we haven't fought. We have death. We have devil. We have sun and moon and we have aeon. So I'm wondering how that's gonna go. I wonder if sun and moon are gonna be like one that show up at the same time. I wonder if Death and Devil are going to show up at the same time and Aeon will show up on its own, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I got my fire-ass winter outfit on, for whatever reason. Could just stay in pajamas all day. Alright. This is going to be interesting. I've located the target. It's in the Iwatodai Station Plaza. <gasps> no! Wait. No, that's not the play. That's not the strip mall. I was going to say, not the strip mall, but... This Whatever. Be the tenth shadow. Yep. Only a few left. Not really the tenth. Let's just worry about them one at a time. Maybe it is the tenth. It's been since no, it's been since April that they've been fighting them. So. If they actually appear one at a time, we don't need two at once again. Should I should have? Oh no, I guess I couldn't really have an opportunity to save anywhere because. It was right before I got in with Junpei, and then right after that, it was straight to uh, this. Yukari chan, how did you know? <laughs> I sensed two of them. <laughs> what? Seriously? <laughs> in my big mouth. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure we are gonna get two here. Where's Shinji? Oh shit, yeah, where is he? He notified me that he'll be joining us later. Fuck, is it to avoid Strega? This is the first full moon. No, 
No, he was there for the, the Hermit one. Because I had him on my team, I remember. That was my first time fighting with him, too, I think. Um, no, I think that was the second time. I think I did a little bit of Tartarus with him before that. I wonder if we won't be able to choose him for our team, which might actually turn my setup into me, I guess, Koromaru, and Junpei. He didn't say why, though. I think it's because Strega. I think him and Strega have some fucking past together also. Figures. They're all the dark and brooding type. By his own rules. I wonder what's going on. I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. You said he'd join us later, right? <laughs> yeah, that's already better than a certain someone who didn't show last time. Okay, he got kidnapped. <laughs> that's fucked up, Yukari. Hey, come on, that wasn't my fault. Okay, it kind of was your fault. Don't worry, I'm totally ready to go this time. See? Yeah, you're level 44. Wait. Oh yeah. Kun isn't here either. This is weird. Hey, I don't Jinpei, like this. Go get him. That'll be your punishment for last time. You shut up, Yukari. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Punishment? What is this kindergarten? <laughs> yeah, and, and uh, when was the last time that you came with on a fucking shadow endeavor, Yukari? Well, I guess it is the kid's bedtime. All right, we've got two targets this time. Let's get moving. Shit, is Junpei not going to we'll be on our team? We'll our team formation once we get there. Okay. Let's go. We'll probably be able to have Junpei on our team then. I just never have him on my team ever again because of it. No Amada. What is going on? This is the route we always take to school. We've got to protect it. Yeah, because it fucking affects us, right? Look how short Fuka is back there. I know his perspective, but also just goddamn. You're like two and a half Koromaru's tall. It's almost like they're waiting for us. Probably are. By the way, where's Amada? <laughs> He's my persona uh, on him. He wasn't in his room, so who knows? Fuck. I don't like this. I don't like this that Aragaki and Amada are both unaccounted for. And fucking, I guess put on some clothes, dude. Why around fucking like naked too. everywhere? Um, we should probably hurry. I think they're about to make their move. Yeah, this is not looking great. And we have no choice. Let's organize a team from the members we have here. <sighs> All right. Set, we'll move in. No Aragaki this time. Okay, thank you for putting fucking clothes on. All right, Koromaru, you're coming with. Uh, what does Junpei's alternate outfit look like? Do I have... Oh, what the fuck was that? All right, give me a second. I'm going to check what that was. Oh, no, I know what that was. That was just the fucking uh, export for the video I was editing being ready. Pirate armor. He does not look like a pirate in that. No, not Fuka. I went all the way to the bottom because I'm so used to changing Aragaki's outfit. What does your Shunjin uniform look like? Probably just going to have him be in his uh, C's uniform. That one looks best. Yeah, with his fucking coat around his waist. His big sash. All right. Well, Kormar, you're coming with us. Excuse me. All right. At least I can save here. I don't, do I have any outfits for Kormar? I think I have like two. I seem to remember having a couple, but I don't think I don't know if they're. I wonder if that's. I think that's a. Persona 5 reference? I don't know. Why do you have a school outfit? That actually does look kind of nice on you, I can't lie. It's a nice switch up from the uh, the white ad adornments? 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 Adornments, I think. I don't fucking know. Let me double save. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get my shit fucking handed to me this time. Cause last time was already hard enough. I mean, I've got I've got items. I've got consumable items. I have 41 life stones now. What the fuck? <laughs> this is all for my fucking grinding in Tartarus. Going through Tartarus several times recently. I have so many life stones. And I bought a bunch of the uh, really good heals. Like this. This is going to be really helpful, having all this. 
Um, I also still have two bead chains, which is nice. Um, I know I have a couple beads. Where are my beads? Yeah, I got six beads. Those will be helpful. Um, plenty of these, so that'll be nice. All right. Can I just go to Wild Dog Burger, please? Okay. Here we go. Yes. I'm guessing that it's going to be Tower or Devil Shadow. Standing by to provide support. Oh, was that? Be careful no, because we already had Emperor and Empress. That was like, I think that was the one that happened after Priestess, because that happened at like the start of Tartarus at the entrance when Fuka showed up. Um, it's not lovers. Who is this? Maybe it's death. I figured death would be like the last one, though. Who is this? Watch this not even be the, the shadow. No, it probably is. What the fuck is that thing? Maybe it's Tower. Have we fought the strength one yet? The fortune arcana. Fortune. Is gone? Wait. The strength arcana must have done Oh, it something. is strength arcana. I figured because I, I I always remembered um Yuko's picture having the girl and the lion. And so that reminded me of this. Um Okay, so I just can't hit that one. Yeah, it's looking like it. None of my theurgy stuff is ready. I mean, Koromaru's is close, but... I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. Oh, what the hell? All right, let's start with the Mishiguji uh, heavy electric attack. <laughs> okay, well, that didn't work. Um... Let's just try a little pierce shot. Okay. Let's see. Uh, let's try fire then. And then of course the dark damage. Please don't reflect. 183. Okay. What the fuck? What was that? What? what the fuck is going on? Oh, is this gonna choose what's gonna fucking happen? Is blue good? Okay. What the fuck is going on? This is crazy. It looks like wherever it stops, it will activate a different effect. Yep. I guess that makes sense with the fortune arcana. What? That's that's pretty fucking cool. Where it stops is random, and I can't predict it. But either way, be careful. All right, we got this. What the heck just happened? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, Where's so physical stuff is not good. And then, uh, what to do? Never mind. Oh, I can't. I can't even check to see what the fortune arcana is weak to. Okay. Let's see, 42 magic, so I could probably do a lot of damage. 48 magic. Maybe I should switch to Parvati and use a heavy ice. This one. I've already scanned this what to one. Do. And then I guess I guess is gonna have to start running a uh, support. It is time. Let's raise our defense. That'll be helpful. What's the plan? Um, we could really only do this. It's really only a point to doing this. I guess a little bit of damage that we can get in. Um, heavy dark. 
257 is pretty damn good. My theurgy's getting close to the Oh yeah, fuck you. You ain't hitting shit. Yeah, uh... I'll go with. It's doing, it's doing, it's doing damage. Alright. If anything, I can heal with I guess. I think I should just focus on my magical attacks for my magical prowess characters. Um... I'll do raise party's attack for three turns. It'll extend past um, what the fucking fortune arcana has been doing. I don't need that. Yeah, I'm mean, just keep doing this with Junpei. He's not going to do any damage if I try to do physical attacks. Okay, theurgy time. Yeah, I don't want the physical attack one. It's going to be really bad here. Big money. Big money. That is pretty big money. Critical rate up. Fuck. Oh yeah, here we go. Wish I had the thing that let me uh, take away the um, buffs. Oh fuck, please don't land on 300 health minus. Fuck! Oh, Junpei's dead. Alright. Targeting both friend and foe. Can that still be called an attack? Um, well, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, bead chain. Here we go. Junpei is down for the count right now. Thank you for your support. Activating. I suppose that means that I can um, instead use this to revive Junpei. So I guess is kind of my uh, my wild card at the moment. Maybe the Fortune Arcana will take increased physical damage and then it'll kind of balance out. We'll see. We just gotta keep doing this. I have plenty of healing stuff, so I just need to be smart with it. Again? Fuck. Attack, defense, accuracy, evasion, please. That's what I'm asking for. I don't need the healing or the SP right now. You fucking rock, Fuka. You're awesome. Alright. I'm thinking I'll use Igis um, to heal the whole team. I'm gonna do the 200 HP to all allies. If Junpei's even a little bit under full health, he's gonna die from that 300. What's the plan? I can do at the moment. Yeah, I have full health on everybody, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. It's not gonna hit fortune, but that's fine. Six forty, that's really good. What's next? We're really messing up the strength arcana. I had a way harder time with the uh, hermit, but you know, I could always pull something out of the out of the fucking back pocket of its dress. Here we go. Let's see, does Junpei die again? Probably gonna have to heal up after this one.
What does that mean? Okay. All right then. I only have the one theurgy. I'm not gonna use my theurgy. That was oh, that is a big increase then. Okay. Please kill. Please kill. Oh yes. All right. Don't revive it, Fortune. Don't revive it. That is such an odd... Why does the Fortune Arcana look like that? The Fortune Shadow. Alright, let's see what this motherfucker's weak to. Ooh, Bash and Lightning. Ma Macha Machaguji? Masaguji, is that his name? Masaguchi? I can't remember what my fucking leech guy's name is. Can't stop me now. Fuck you, bitch. Now. Eat shit. Let him have it, fellas. <laughs> Let him have it, fellas. <laughs> He's so goofy. Oh, you are so fucked. Woo! I've already scanned this one. Woo! I've already scanned this one. Okay. So it will take heavy dark damage. That's good. Motherfucker. Oh my. Oh my god. Koromaru. You monster. Alright. Mishiguji. Well, Mishiguji is about to fucking murder you. Yeah, do your, do your fucking screech. Oh, okay. How'd you get back up? What the fuck? Oh, fuck you. We're not losing. Oh, fuck. No, no, no. No. Uh, huh? Nothing's happening? Oh, I don't like this. I really don't fucking like this. finish it off. <laughs> um, I don't like this. Uh... It was red, and it had, a, like, a reaper symbol. Does that mean death for everybody? This foreshadowing? Is everybody gonna fucking die? Are we just not gonna mention what just fucking happened? I'm really worried about that. Oh man, it's exhausting dealing with two of them at once. The two claiming to be Strega did not interfere this time. They're probably getting Chidori. It's probably because we have their navigator. They can't outmaneuver us. That or Aragaki is like beating the shit out of them. <laughs> anyway, I'm glad everything went well. No, don't fucking say that. Still, Aragaki Senpai never showed, huh? Amatakun too. Is Shinji gonna be dead? <laughs> the chairman doesn't seem to be too concerned. He's already headed home. I don't like his Do you know attitude either. Sorry, I haven't been able to locate them yet. <sighs> Let's return to the dorm for the time being. We're gonna run into Strag on the way. Yeah, I don't like this. Akihiko, are you listening? Yeah, but he's thinking. Today is. October 4th, right? Oh no, just something happened two years ago on October 4th. Yeah, that's right. Go on back without me. I'm gonna go look for them. What the fuck happened? Wait, senpai, I wonder what's up. Akihiko. Send me, send me. Let me go with them. Yeah, what the fuck is going on? Are they about to fight Strega? You came, just like we agreed. What is going on? Do you know why I called you here? Are you guys gonna fight? You probably have an idea, since you skipped the operation for it. Are you bad? Are you Two evil? Two years ago today, on October 4th, that was the day my mom died here. They called it a car accident, but it wasn't. I saw the whole thing. 
I saw my mom get killed. And that's the person that was in your photo. You murdered her. Oh shit. Since then, not one good thing has happened. Just being alive is torture. And all I get from people is sympathy. No matter where I go. What's the point of living like this? I've even thought about killing myself. But I wouldn't be able to face mom like that. That's why I vowed to live until I found her killer. You! And that's why Aragaki quit, because he got somebody killed. I once heard you say you wanted to forget what you did on that day. So, when I realized it was a full moon today, I knew I had to confront you. Today, Mom is with me. I'll make you remember what you did to her. I'm gonna kill you! Fuck's Aragaki gonna let him kill him? Do it. Huh. No one else is I do it? not like this. I don't like this. That fucking Wheel of Fortune board landing on the the Reaper. Man, I wonder why Sonata san was acting so weird. Something about the date. Kiri or Kiri Joe, do you not? What's so special about October 4th? October 4th. That's right. I we was have so to go over there. on the operation that I didn't realize it. Today is the anniversary of the day Amada's mother was killed. She was killed? Yamagishi, I need you to locate Aragaki and Amada immediately. There's a good chance they'll be together. Akihiko must have already realized it. I I'm on it. Uh, what's going this on? This is not good. Public records say that Amada's mother was killed in an accident, but in truth, we were the ones responsible for her death. What? It happened two years ago, when we were hunting down a shadow that appeared in the city. Aragaki had only just awakened his persona, and he lost control of it for a moment. Shit. we have been so focused on the shadow, we hadn't accounted for any civilians in the area. Unfortunately, there was one casualty. It was Amada's mother. No way! Are you kidding me? Wait, so to Amada-kun, Aragaki-senpai is... I should have considered this when Amada volunteered to join us. It's possible that he... I found them! They're at Tatsumi Port Island! They're together. And I'm picking up someone else, too. Sonata? Is it Akihiko? Wait, this is... Fuck, is it fucking Slim Jesus? No, it's Striga! Hey, isn't that a problem? This couldn't be worse. Yeah, this is really fucking bad. Senpai! Come on, we gotta follow her. Alright? Do it. I won't stop you. You're right. I just wanted to forget. That's why I left everyone behind. And tried to use the drugs to suppress my power. But nothing I did could erase the memory. No matter what I do, I always end up back here. It's my fault. This is what I deserve. But I gotta give you a warning. A warning. You take my life, and you're going to end up just like me. You better be prepared for that. What? Are you begging for your life? Even if all you have now is hatred, one day you'll regret it. Shut up! That's bullshit! I must say, I agree. Fucking Slim Jesus, you motherfucker. <laughs> well, I guess we get to see if they know each other now. These are not his sins to bear. That is the nature of revenge. 
Is it not permissible to kill those who are themselves killers? What is this right. fucking group of people having this interaction here? This is crazy. Fucking Slim Jesus. Uh, Takaya, don't fucking bring your, your weird philosophy on this kid. What do you want? Losing one of our own has posed a slight challenge for us, but we cannot simply turn a blind eye to all the trouble you've caused. Oh shit! He stopped slouching, he took his hands out of his pockets. Fear not. This life is but a stepping stone. Don't fucking shoot him. I shall deliver unto you both salvation. So he doesn't have to feel bad for killing Aragaki and so that Aragaki can die. What'd you say? My protecting your would be murderer. This is fucking nuts. Oh, but that's right. Whether or not to this boy's revenge, you are fated to die regardless. Especially with that wheel of fortune. What does he mean? And also the drugs, I assume that kills you. You've been taking those suppressants for some time now. You don't have much longer. That's bullshit! Listen to your body. The signs have already begun. <laughs> what are you talking about? <sighs> Fuck. Going to die? No matter what? Come on, fight it, Aragaki. Even if I don't do anything? That's not fair! This is all I've been living for! What was even the point then? The cause of death is hardly of importance. This is fucking crazy. Besides, the breath of life is faint in you as well, child. You were planning to join him once the deed was done, were you not? Damn! Mara, what? This may be a bit ill-timed, but no matter. It matters not whose life I take first. You're both destined to perish anyway. Shut the fuck up! Ooh. Shit! <laughs> no! Now then, with what life you have left, answer me this. There is a navigator in your rank similar to Chidori. Do not fuck not? with Fuka. You've been killing the shadows we wish to protect with startling efficiency before we can even arrive. Tell me, which one of you is it? Oh, don't fucking tell him, Aragaki. If you don't expedite your answer, then this will hurt you more than it hurts me. Fuck, is Amada gonna tell him? Fuck you, Slim Jesus. I thought we were friends. What's wrong? Cat got your tongue. Or are you ready to talk? <laughs> There's no one. No. Wait. No. Don't. Me. Oh shit! Really now? It's the truth. That's the only reason they let me join. Even though I'm a kid. <laughs> Who are you? God damn. Quiet. I wasn't talking to you. Is Sonata gonna show up? Come on, Sonata, show it up. Doesn't matter now. I'll never have my revenge. I don't have any reason to live. What's the point in fighting anymore? I see. So, you accept salvation. What a beautiful end to your life. Sonata, come on. Pull through. Fuck him up. Very well. Hit him in the back of the head. You could probably kill him in one punch. First. Rest peacefully. <laughs> No. Mom. 
No! Fuck! Fuck! Takaya's not gonna understand this. Just what was that for? What reason could you possibly have to risk your life for this child? Shinji! Your companions? How very unfortunate. The fun had just begun. Shinji! Hang in there! Aragaki! Senpai! Aragaki-san! No. Fuck, man. He was a he was a fucking good dude. He was a good dude. Now Mata's gonna have to live with that. can't imagine I don't even know how we're going to interact with each other from now on things are just going to be different like we were getting by so easily now we like legitimately fucking had one of our teammates die can express the sense of loss we feel as a result of this terrible tragedy. He had a lifetime of opportunity ahead of him. As educators, we are to blame for ignoring his silent calls for help. We tragically lost him to senseless violence before we had a chance to help him realize his true potential. Forgive us. Forgive us for our negligence. He just never stops talking. Shut up. 
I feel so bad for Kirijo and Sonata. I'd never even heard of any Aragaki. Had you? I heard he never came to school. Probably just some punk. Oh, I just want to get home. I gotta study for my mock exam. Hey, you guys know who this Aragaki is? Wait, you're not even in the same year. No way you'd know him then. Anyways, it's crazy that stuff like this really happens, huh? Shut your fucking mouth. Huh? What the hell's your problem? Shut up. No, Jinpei. Huh? What are you getting up for? Actually, you know what, Junpei? Sock him in his fucking mouth. I said shut the hell up! Iori, sit down. No, Maya, let this shit happen. Damn it! Just ignore them, Junpei. <laughs> no, who are these people? Have you seen Sonata Senpai today? There's no way he would show up. Hmm. He was absent this morning. I wonder if he'll show up at all. I hope he's okay. There's no way he can be. Same with Kirijo. Do you have a moment? Are we get in trouble? Oh, sure. When you get back today, let's meet in the lounge. I think you all know the reason. Right. I don't expect you to have your thoughts in order. I'm not even sure what to do myself. All right. I'll see you then. So it's about Amada, huh? Well, this will be a fun meeting. Yeah. Fucking hell. <sighs> My fucking team. Those are my buddies. Me, Igis, Koromaru, and Aragaki. Basically the Koromaru team. He was the fucking glue that held us together. Damn. <sighs> Sonata gonna show up now? the usual for lunch I was wondering what ramen tastes like when you skip class it's surprisingly good you could have invited me at least once you know come on say something why do you have to be like that always going off without saying a word put yourself in my shoes for a change you think it's the other way around? Yeah. You're right. I was always the one running off on my own. I was too obsessed with getting stronger. Ever since I lost Miki. That's all I've cared about. Fucking hell, man. I thought if I was strong enough, I could protect anyone. But I was wrong. And now you're gone too. God. It's like the world is laughing at me. This game better not do this shit again, because I don't think I can take losing another fucking teammate. I knew what we were getting into. I knew we were putting our lives on the line. But I was so focused on fighting that I didn't see anything else. It doesn't matter how strong I was. Look what happened! <laughs> I 
I know, Shinji. Crying won't change anything, right? I don't need you to tell me that. In the end, I can't run away from who I am. I've had enough of this. Whoa! Is that justice? Rest easy, Shinji. You just watch from there with me. I've still got a job to do. Isn't that right? You all know the reason we're gathered here. Yeah. We need to discuss how to deal with Amada. I've already consulted the chairman. I guess bring him here. Understood. Can we really let him stay on the team? It's I mean, my fault. he has no reason to try to kill anybody now, but. No, it's not your fault, Fuka. And it's not Amada's fault. This was both Takaya and Aragaki's choices that led us here. I knew it was strange when Aragaki Senpai told me he'd be late, but I didn't say anything. It's not your fault. If I'd only listened to my intuition, this wouldn't have happened. No. This isn't on you. That's right. It's not your fault. If there's anyone who should have realized, it's No, me. and it's not on you either. And it's not on Sonata for not bringing everybody with. I should have been taking things more seriously, too. Everybody was doing what they could. We had no idea what was going to happen. I knew this wasn't a game. But I never thought it'd end up like this. Fuck, I really think more people are going to die. I don't know who would be. I feel like I'm going to die at some point. I feel like my character's going to fucking die. There's no point dwelling on the past. Shinji's last words were, this is how it should be. He was a hell of a guy. <laughs> he even faced death with a smile. So, from this day forward, I'll face things head on too. It's a good resolve to come out with, and yes, he was a hell of a guy. This is how it should be. Huh. Senpai. Reporting in. Amada-san is not in his room. Fuck. He's not? Evidence indicates that his window has been pried open. Amada-kun! Wait, Fuka, where are you going? Do you even know where to look? Well, no, but we can't just let him go off on his own, right? We'll, we'll, we'll try to sense him. You're just gonna run around without a clue? You'll never find him like that. Maybe not, but we have to try. Amada kun has nowhere else to go. I know exactly how that feels. But where do we even look? Maybe the alleyway, maybe the shrine. <laughs> you of all people should understand, Yukari chan! Luca. What is going on? I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to. Give him some time. Dragging him back won't change how he feels. And we can't protect him forever. Akihiko. It's his choice. He's the only one who can decide how to live his life. It's a good way to look at things after recent events. Considering we just lost somebody. 
and they made an ultimate choice on their life. We all choose our own paths. Yep, Aragaki chose his own just as much as everybody else does. Oh, fuck. Come on, guys, we just lost somebody. Can we not, can we not fight? Don't give me this fucking music. I speculate. No. I think. Everybody's reached a very strong tension point. Could too. Yeah. How you doing, your car? Hey, so... I almost said, "Oh, who's not down here?" Realizing that not only is Aragaki dead, but Amada's run away. Sonata's upstairs, but I probably can't talk to him either. Is he up on the roof? Get this music out of my ears. Looks like he's not up here. I should check Aragaki's room. What am I doing calling him Aragaki? That was Shinji. That man was Shinji to me. That stuff. If I had known, I would have left it there. Someone was in here, so I came to check. What's that? He was gonna go back. Did you find this? I see. He made a habit of not leaving behind any personal belongings. I have no idea when he filled out this form to return to school, or whether he even planned to hand it in. But I think this is proof that he was thinking about the promise we made. I may have bothered him about it. I never knew his situation, and it's possible I just made things worse for him. I think if he knew we felt guilty, he'd just tell us to mind our own business. He probably would. Probably call us dumbasses, too. I should show Akihiko. Or, actually, maybe I shouldn't. He probably wouldn't approve. Let's just keep this between us for now. It sounds like you know how to handle those two now. Thanks to you, I was able to understand how he really felt. I'll say this on behalf of all three of us. Thank you so much. Here. You take this. It should go to you, since 
You're the one who got him to open up. Someday, once we leave the storm, then I'll tell Akihiko. I'll tell him about his struggle returning to this room to fulfill the promise we made. That he never forgot those days when it was just the three of us. Not even for a moment. This song's gonna fucking haunt me. Hellbiker, the hooligan of the underworld. Hi, Kiri Joe. Well, <sighs> hmm? I can't raid his fridge. He'd probably be upset if I raided his fridge. No, nah, he 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 wouldn't. He wouldn't want anything to go to waste. Nothing on his shelves. <sighs> yeah, I'm getting out of here. Find Sonata anywhere. What's you up? Have my thanks. Hi, buddy. I know. Yeah, let's go. I need some. I need some Igus Koromaru stuff. Usual. I observe no abnormalities in Koromaru-san's physical or mental status today. At least he's doing all right after what happened. May I have a moment of your time? There is something I wish to speak with you about. All right. <sighs> I was performing research today and came across a puzzling Not the piece fucking of song again. <sighs> Stated that there is a specific time of year in which one can reunite with the dead. Are you talking about Halloween? It appears as though spirits return to the living realm during this time. Am I gonna see Aragaki on Halloween? What exactly does this mean? I mean, it's just superstition. Once an organism comes to the end of its lifespan, its physical body will deteriorate. But does this mean that there is a spirit? that exists independent of one's physical form? I mean, we're in a world that have personas, which are embodiments of us. And in that case, would that mean that Aragaki-san is... <laughs> Welcome back, Koromaru-san. Hmm? What are you holding? Thanks, it appears buddy. as though he wishes us to have it. Why don't we gratefully accept? Now, let's return to the dorm, shall we? Yeah. I gotta fuse that persona. Fuck, man. I should cut it off here. Junpei's not here. Yukari's not here. <sighs> that one's gonna fucking sting for a while. <sighs> I'm gonna figure out how to how to fuse that persona. I need to. I need to keep it in my inventory. Alright. Let me get the hell out of here. 
Ugh. All right. He'll live on within seas. Well, until we next meet. God damn it. Okay. I'm gonna get out of here. Try to process some of this. <sighs> do what I can in order to avenge Aragaki. Until then. Until then. <laughs>